Yo, what's up dudes? It's your boy Eagle Brother, and I'm back with episode 36 of my Borderlands 2 Legendary Weapons Guide. Today guys, we're gonna be going over the bitch submachine gun. In my case, I have the social bitch, OP level 10. Your case of bitch might be a little bit different, but it will be some variation of the bitch. I know I've said it like five times, but I just enjoy saying it. The red text says, yep, back. This gun can come in all elements. We do have ourselves a corrosive one and the accuracy on this thing is absolutely insane at 97 you guys can see there the corrode chance of course since we do have a corrosive is pretty decent as well and you guys are going to see that in the gameplay but of course we're going to show you how to unlock this gun who you need to farm for it and then of course some gameplay and go through the wiki at the end so to get this beast we're going to be farming the bunker located in thousand cuts so we're going to fast travel over to thousand cuts and of course bunker being one of the most difficult bosses that you come across at least within your first couple playthroughs he's not too bad you know once you've gotten it down once you've gotten enough loot gear everything's looking good on your side these okay he's, he's, he's pretty easy especially when you're using uh, a hat pimper no glitch but when you first come across bunker he is a bitch and a pain in the ass to kill so we are going to be running through thousand cuts first to get to where the bunker is once we do get to the bunker it's a really easy farm super easy but you do need to travel across thousand cuts to get to them so just follow the path i'm going to speed this up for you guys' convenience make it uh, so you're not listening to me for 10 minutes and i'll be right back with you guys All right, so now you guys have made it to the bunker and every time now when you do save and quit you're gonna be right here so you don't have to make that trek again thank god because that thing is a pain in the ass uh but you are gonna have to run up here to get the bunker to spawn and as i mentioned you know bunker is pretty easy especially once you've gotten later in the game once you've gotten more comfortable with the bunker you could even bore shot with zero and bunker goes down in like two shots but I just know I remember back playing this first second playthrough man the bunker was such a pain as one of the last bosses in the main story so you guys do have to complete through you have to pretty much get you have to get to this point uh, and have to complete or at least progress through the main story there's bunker you know one shot of course I am using the glitch the cheese Ahab Pimpernel so that's gonna happen but um but wanted to get these legendaries out as soon as possible for you dude that's why I do use this glitch to kill these bosses as soon as I can just to uh, show you guys these legendaries but you'd have to complete uh the story mode and progress quite a bit through it towards the end when you do unlock the bunker you'll see some loaders kind of spawning here and there but when you do a and if you do kill the bunker that fast he will spawn back and you still have to shoot him one time i don't know if you guys know that with the warrior as well let's say you kill the warrior super fast uh the warrior still has like a one last little spawn that he has to do same thing with bunker you shoot it one time and now it is completely dead so um we're gonna go ahead and just kind of watch the loot and you're gonna see the bitch right there right in front of my face i don't know if you guys saw it but it was right in front of my face drop down there and there it is i've also gotten some other weird ones from this guy i've gotten slaga recently i've gotten the w2 wtf shield from bunker so uh, it you know random spawns i feel like are pretty somewhat consistent kind of with this or random loot drops i guess with this with this boss but anyway guys that is the drop we're going to show you guys some gameplay and go through the wiki the bitch is a legendary submachine gun of borderlands 2 manufactured by hyperion it is obtained randomly from any suitable loot source but has an increased chance to drop from bunker located in the bunker the special weapon effects the red text says yep back increased accuracy magazine size and crit hit damage greatly increased recoil reduction rate so as I'm going through this gameplay, I want you guys to notice when I first shoot the gun, it kind of does have a recoil kick. It kicks up a little bit, but as you fire, that as you hold down the trigger, you can see that reticle get pretty much pinpoint at that point. So really crazy accuracy on this freaking thing, man. And again, I am using a corrosive, so I probably should have brought this in with like a 
area where there's a bunch of bots, but it's still doing a lot of freaking damage even to that ultimate badass right there. Like, I, I feel like those psychos, man, I don't know what it is, but I, sometimes they're just very hard to take out, but with the bitch, very seamless. Seemed like it was super easy to take him out. Use it in description says, in sustained fire, the bitch reaches its peak accuracy faster than most Hyperion SMGs, even those of similar or higher levels, and has noticeably better overall stats. Its deep magazine, near perfect accuracy, and critical hit damage bonus make it an ex excellent choice for almost any combat situation, especially attaining a second wind. The bitch is an overall powerful weapon, having minimal weaknesses and strong stats due to its greatly reduced recoil minus 125%, it can be used at nearly any range with great effectiveness, making it versatile and reliable for any character. Uh, a couple things uh, on this, the bunker does drop this at a 3.3% drop rate. So, you know, it's it's not <laughs> that uh, common. I mean, 3.3% is a better drop rate than some uh, legendaries, but you guys are going to be farming the bunker quite a bit, especially if you want to get the variant you want, especially if you want to, if you, let's say, get it on a lower level than what you're at. You guys are going to be farming bunker for a bit, but we were lucky enough to get this. I think we farmed him maybe about an hour-ish, uh, trying to go for the, the, the sham as well as the bitch. Obviously got the bitch in this case, but he does also drop the sham shield, which is the best shield in the game in my opinion. But as you guys can see, we are absolutely tearing through these enemies, man. We are on OP level 10 gameplay, so nothing, no sugar coating there. And this thing is just absolute animal. We are rocking the B shield though. So if you guys wanted to see, you know, you know, maybe if you're not rocking B shield, the damage might be less. Probably it will be less than what I'm doing now, but this coped with the B shield, you know, with Maya being able to phase lock and pretty much get all these enemies in slag is probably one of my favorite combos in the game absolutely amazing phenomenal just shreds through enemies left and right but anyway guys that was the bitch submachine gun one of my favorites and the best submachine guns in the game so definitely go get this freaking thing you guys are going to want that and that was the episode if you guys are enjoying definitely let me know in the comments man i'm having a blast pumping these out for you guys trying to get through this as fast as possible i have another idea on another series uh with borderlands 2 i know we're playing a game that's 10 years old but we have ideas on top of ideas so trying to get through these legendary weapons quick and then go into maybe another series where we kill enemies like a hundred times or something and see exactly what we get so we'll see we're gonna be pumping these out daily so if you do enjoy it man please hit the like button definitely helps out a lot and i will catch you guys in the next episode thanks so much for stopping by Peace.